show you guys how to create a digital download using Shopify and this is a question I've gotten a lot and I'm actually doing it right now so I thought now is the time to share so you'll notice that when you go to add product in Shopify there is nothing to suggest that there's a way to upload a digital download of any kind so this could be a song or an ebook or a procreate brushes basically any sort of digital form product that you create so what you need to do is download the digital download app in the Shopify apps. Now, I just wanna point out that I have it downloaded and you still can't see anything that suggests that it's here. So I'm gonna show you exactly what to do in that case. I'm gonna to go to apps right here and then you'll see I have it right here, but what you're gonna do is just go to visit the Shopify app store. It's a free add-on. My internet's slow. Okay, search apps, digital download and then you will see it, this black one right here. So just download that. So I'm gonna go back and to add my product. So I'm gonna go to products. So I'm going back to add my product and I am going to, let's just title it download number one. I can put a description in here later, add photos later, but I'm going to save it. And then after I save it, what I'm going to do is go back into it. So see, I'm in this product again, and now you can see the download, duplicate, or more actions. You're gonna wanna click more actions, and then add digital attachment. So I'm gonna click that, and that is where my digital download gets uploaded. So this can be really confusing because you would think that it should be within um, the listing, but it's not because it's the app. And this is the digital downloads app, and this is where you are going to upload. So it is kind of a separate thing. So I'm going to open up a Procreate brush to put in here, Procreate brushes. So I'm uploading a brush set, I'm gonna say open, and then that will upload. And then I can change the settings of this so I can go to settings right here. And what this is gonna do is allow it to automatically fulfill, and that's default. So basically any digital goods and people will be able to automatically download it, and that's it. And you should be good to go. You can publish your digital product and be on your way. So hope that's helpful, guys.